Upper Pomeroon community of St. Monica is hoping to develop its ecotourism potential to boost economic development. St. Monica, located in the Upper Pomeroon River, is considering ways of developing its economic potential. During a meeting with residents on Sunday, Minister within the Ministry of Indigenous Peoples Affairs, Honorable Valerie Garrido Lo, noted that ecotourism is one way in which the community can boost its economy. You need to establish, other than lumber, a strong village economy, be it agriculture, which we are pushing and supporting, or ecotourism, because hinterland is beautiful. Hinterland is beautiful, and that is one of your assets. The minister noted that there is support for persons venturing into the sector in areas such as training of tour guides, bookings, catering for guests, and other areas. In this regard, Minister Garrido Lo has committed to having an official from the Ghana Tourism Authority visit the community and conduct an assessment of its tourism potential. Nicholas Courtman, headmaster of the St. Monica Primary School, noted that the village has tourism potential. I'm happy if we can benefit from that tourism sector because I know that St. Monica is a beautiful place. It's just that it needs some attention to make some of our landmarks and land sites a lot more attractive than they are right now. We have some beautiful hills, we have some nice river and um, sites in the backlands that need to be developed. We have a shell mound here. The community currently has accommodation and catering services for visitors to the village. The building boasts 17 rooms, a kitchen, conference hall, and is powered by solar energy. It was also made available for guests. Recently, the community benefited from a refurbished school, health post, and teachers' quarters, and free internet access. Reporting for InfoHub, Natasha Smith.